and we are back in Dark Souls Remastered. I'm at Firelink Shrine. I'm going to talk to people to make sure they don't have any new dialogue. Have you been to the ruins of New Londo below? Just head down the stairs and take the lift. It's certainly worth a visit. It was once an undead city. You may find a clue or two, unless the ghosts find you first. <laughs> How did that nutty sorcerer make it back? Unexpected, but I suppose stranger things have happened. You again? There's nothing to speak about, really. Oh, actually, something strange did happen. That crow flew off with somebody in its clutches. I think it was a man curled up in a ball. Stranger things have happened, right? No, maybe not. Hmm? What now? I'm not up for chatting. Leave me alone. So, of course, my dog started eating her supper, so I have to mute the mic. Oh, hello. Miracles, I presume? Yes, I know. Come again. The effectiveness of the teachings depends... Let's go talk to uh, the apprentice who's over here now. Oh, hello. I regret meeting you under such compromising circumstances. At least we both made it back unscathed. Oh, hello. Terrific to see us both in one piece. And pray that you never go hollow. Oh, hello. Terrific to see us both in one piece. And pray that you never go hollow. Somebody's snoring here. Okay, my dog is finished eating now. So, um, we heard uh, the Crestfallen Knight tell us about a crow that carried somebody away after they curled up in a ball. And uh, if we, um, if we were to curl up in a ball here, the crow would come and take us away as well. And I'm thinking... I'm thinking I might do this. This will take us back to the Undead Asylum. 
I'm actually trying to remember if the boss fight is required or not. We have the key that we picked up from the top of the church over there. Um... I'm not, I'm not sure that I'm ready to do this. Um... So, okay, so here's what I'm gonna do. I am going... Go back... Back down here. Oops, that was a long fall. Back down to the shrine, the bonfire. We talked to Griggs, the sorcerer's apprentice over there, although he didn't have nearly as much to say as I thought he would. Uh, Crestfallen Knight also told us about the new Londo ruins. If we go down the stairs. Lotric is still here. Well... Where have you been? <laughs> I'm glad to see you're safe. Are you, though? Have you heard of trusty patches? If ever a man has rubbed me up the wrong way, whew, if he ever comes around again, I swear I'll have his hide. Trusty patches? Hmm. You again. What is it? Our futures are murky. Let's not be too friendly now. Okay. That's interesting. I don't think I've ever heard him talk about patches before. It does sort of behoove you to talk to all the NPCs after pretty much every significant event in the game. Okay, so, um, I'm thinking, I'm sort of consulting my notes here, and I'm thinking that I might, I think I'm just gonna go kill the Capra Demon. I think that's sort of my next goal here. I was waffling there for a second because I thought maybe I should go back to the Undead Asylum first. Oh, hello. Terrific to see us both in one piece and pray. Yeah, he has nothing to say. Nothing else to say, I guess. I thought perhaps I should. Whoops, go through here. Perhaps I should go to the Undead Asylum. But, um, if I have to fight that boss there, um, I, th I am not sure that I'm ready for that yet. So we're gonna come all the way back past the merchant here, back to the lower undead burg. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave that guy. I don't need to kill him. Just run right past. Walk up to this thief and backstab him. Probably should have done that with two hands, but whatever. <laughs> well, that was easy. Um, I'm actually sort of realizing that I probably should have spent some of these souls before I, uh, came out here. But, oh well. There's actually a fairly significant chance that I'm gonna die here. I, I would say I am an experienced Dark Souls player, but I am certainly not experienced enough to expect that I can one-shot the Capra Demon. So, okay, let me, uh, let me, uh, mentally prepare myself, sort of visualize what's going to happen. 
when I go through here. I guess it's fairly obvious that going through here is going to lead to a boss fight. Um, let me heal up. I have 11 Estus Flasks, that's good. I have a plus one weapon, that's good. I have my shield, that's good. I think I'm as ready as I'm ever gonna be. Let's go. Okay, we're not off to a bad start already. Can't see a damn thing. Trying to get up these stairs. Heal, heal, heal. Oh, damn it. I got hit. What hit me? Trying to get this stupid, uh... Damn it. He keeps hitting me and I can't hit him. Those dogs are so awful. Drink, drink, drink. Get that dog. That dog is the main problem I have. Oh, damn it, I fell. All right, come here, dog. Not my dog. Seriously? I got him. Okay, excellent. Okay, now, now we can start working on the Capra Demon. Okay, now I feel much more confident. I spent a long time learning how to block this guy. God, the camera is really bad in this, in this arena. God, I'm not, I'm really not doing very much damage to this guy. You know, I kind of wonder. Oh God. I'm in trouble, I'm in trouble, I can't see. I just used, oh my God, really? How the hell? Okay, okay, let's get going here. How the bloody hell? Okay, there we go, that's better. Get some damage going on this guy. Oh my god, I'm so lucky there. Trouble, trouble. God, this is nerve wracking. <laughs> this is the. First hard fight. I got hit. Oh, I knew that was gonna hit me. Why did I dodge? Drink, drink, drink. Dodge. Ah, oh, that didn't dodge in time. My lightnings. Lightnings run out. Okay, don't panic. Don't panic, whatever you do. You're still in this fight. You got not much more to go. Just stay focused on what you're doing, even though you can't see a damn thing because the camera. Yes! Victory achieved! We got the key to the depths of humanity and a homeward bone. Whew, and 6,000 souls. Oh man, that was... That was nerve-wracking. I was not prepared for how nerve-wracking that was. Here is the message. Yes, there, that is a good place to uh, stay there. To uh, sort of... Um, avoid... You can't really avoid him there, but um, it does give you a little bit of breathing room. 
Okay, let's breathe. We're at 15 minutes on this recording. Okay, so we, uh, we took care of the Capra Demon. We got the key that we need to get to the next part of the game. And, uh, I'm coughing and clearing my throat a lot. All right, so this door was locked before. We are now going to open it and head down into the depths. Why is my, um, block key not working? Wow, that was serious lag there. That was weird. Okay, let's head into this area. I am thinking I will try to make it to the, the next available bonfire. Now oh, there's a piece of wood stuck in my back. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> um, I, I'm not completely sure how far away that next bonfire is, but I feel like it's reasonably close. Within five minutes close, at least. It's... It's really disheartening when you wait and wait and wait for the monster to attack and then you start your attack and as soon as you press the attack key, that's when the monster starts their attack. That's really, uh, that's kind of a uh, depressing feeling when that happens. <laughs> okay, let's check out this item over here. Large soul of a nameless soldier. We can see out there there's a whole bunch more hollows with torches. Where, okay, I was just going to say, how do I get down there? We're just going to make our way slowly through this area. Oh, missed by a mile. back here. No, not really. Ugh, I gotta cough a lot. Okay, let's pull some of these guys in. Ouch. I was hoping they would walk into my attack, but they didn't. Missed. Missed again. He just did the thing that I just complained about, where he, he started his attack right when I pressed the button. That's such a sinking feeling. Okay, well at least I hit him that time. There's an area down there that we will get to shortly. Oh, I forgot about this guy down here. What's my time? I'm in 18 minutes, so we gotta fight our way through a... There's a butcher back there. Behind that table. We gotta fight through him, too. Only got two Estus flasks left. Oh, there's a dog. I did an overhead swing there so I wouldn't hit the wall. I'm kind of starting to feel like this, this mace is not working as well as it was before. Okay, so there's another dog. I want to pull that dog. The dog is not pulling. Come on, dog. You know, it kind of looks like I could just walk past these guys. But, no, I'm not going to do that. Seriously, the dog is not pulling. Really would like to get rid of the dog before I engage the butcher. 
quit? Oh, oh my God. Okay, we're in trouble right now. We're in serious, serious trouble. And we're dead. Okay, uh, that, <laughs> that is an example of how things can go from under control to completely out of control in a matter of seconds. And here we are, <coughs> excuse me, way back at Firelink Shrine. Okay, so I guess, uh, I guess, um, I guess I'll stop here, and next time I will pick it up. Um, I'm gonna have to go all the way back there and get my souls. That was a lot of souls I dropped on the floor down there. Alright, it should, it's not too hard to get back there, so that won't be a big deal. Alright. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you later.